Welcome to Prince Math Clinic, the e-learning solution at your pace and time. Good day and welcome once again to class. Today we shall be considering this very interesting algebraic statement on the board. And one reason why this algebraic statement is interesting is that 99% of people who attempt this question miss it on their first attempt. And why do they miss it? They miss it because this question is too simple to assume to what to be technical. Let's go right into the solution. This is 3 pi divided by 3 pi. This is an algebraic statement in the sense that 3 pi means 3 times pi. Now that you know it means 3 times pi, let's rewrite this question. 3 pi divided by 3 pi will be equals to 3 times pi divided by 3 times pi. At this stage, we need to introduce the law of precedence or order. And what does that law say? It says in any mathematical operation, you treat bracket first before off, then division, afterwards multiplication, then addition, and lastly, subtraction. In some other material, you have it as PEMDAS or PEMDAS. So in this case, this is what bracket entails. Of division, multiplication, addition, and subtraction. Where this bracket, of and multiplication, means all means multiplication. But there is a way to apply it in solving questions that involve these operations. So let us look at the particular operation we need for this. We have a multiplication here and we have a what? Division. But interestingly, coming from the left to the right, division appears first. So I'm going to treat the division before what? Multiplication. But interestingly, both division and multiplication right, have the same word consequence, meaning that you can treat any of them first. But see what I'm going to do. This is what? 3 times pi. Then this division, I'm still going to write it like this. Then multiply by pi. 3 here cancels out 3 here. So I have pi multiplied by pi. And pi multiplied by pi is the same thing as pi squared. And pi is having a value of 3.14. Multiplied by what? 3.14. And if you multiply this together, you are going to get 9.85. 96. Erroneously, some people will attempt this question and write 3 pi divided by 3 pi. And they say 3 pi cancels 3 pi to give 1. No, it's not correct. To verify what I've just done, kindly visit Wolfram Alpha Calculator. It's a great tool to help you to solve algebraic statements and all some other mathematical equations. Right? The name again is Wolfram Alpha Calculator. Just type Wolfram Alpha and it will display for you on your screen. Right? What I've just done is displayed on the screen for you to verify. I hope this class was helpful. Kindly you share it with your friends and loved ones? Subscribe to this channel because on this channel we are going to get interesting questions like this and all other questions that cuts across different areas in math. Till we meet again, bye.